Hey guys, thanks for stopping by. Um, today we're going to be doing another review, the Right Rub All Purpose Seasoning. Really excited about this one. We also have some uh, awesome uh, ribs here that we're going to be working with from Matador Meats and Wines in Plano, Texas. Um, I'll be showing y'all those here in a second. Check out the marbling on that, guys. That is awesome. That's just perfect. Y'all hang tight and we'll get these seasoned up. All right, guys, welcome back. We got the St. Louis style ribs on the cutting board like I showed y'all earlier. I'm gonna be hanging them with our meat hook here. All right, let's get this seasoning put on it. I'm excited. Look at that color in there. Let's see. Get some good seasoning on in there. I'm gonna get it all over these ribs. Beautiful. All right, y'all hang tight. I'll finish these up and flip them and show you the other side. Here's the other side of those ribs, guys. We're going to season this side up as well, just like the front. Get a lot on there. Man, I'm excited to use these St. Louis-style ribs from Matador Meats and Wine in Plano, man. It's going to be really good. I'm excited. That's what we're looking like. Y'all hang tight. Welcome back everybody. Uh, looks like we got some fire rolling here. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to go ahead and put the barrel right on top of my coal box here. that let it get a little airflow and we'll shut it down and get these ribs in be right back with you I'm real happy with that color from the right rub again I'll show you that right rub all-purpose seasoning really put a great color on these ribs I mean they already look great the ribs already look great without being seasoned Look at the marbling in there. Man. Alright, y'all hang tight. Let's get these tossed on. Alright, let's get these ribs put on real quick. Looking awesome already. Right here. Hang them right over here. All right, y'all hang tight. How y'all doing? Uh, it's been not even an hour yet. Just wanted to slide in a quick Barlow crouch. See what you've been doing this whole time, Barlow, and it's pretty impressive. Cheers to you, buddy. Y'all go check his channel out. I'll put his information in the description box. Um, but yeah, I'll get right back with y'all in the hour mark when we check on these ribs. Hang tight. Alright guys, we're about an hour and a half in and I went ahead and added one more hickory chunk there as you can see. Just wanted to update y'all. I'll be back with y'all. Thanks for hanging out with, while we're barbecuing. Welcome back y'all. We're about to pull these ribs off and take a look at them. Reminder, the rub we're using is Right Rub All-Purpose Seasoning. Um, Y'all, let's check these ribs out. It's the two-hour mark. Bet they're looking great. Oh, jeez. Pullback is looking awesome. Let's get these off. Take a sneak. Yes, sir. That is what I'm looking for. Oh, wow. Wow. What we're going to do is real simple. Hold on, let me just show you all these real quick before I move forward. Wow. Alright, 
what we're going to do is real simple guys we're just going to take some apple juice pour it in this mixing bowl here and take some rub and follow it up after we put this apple juice on this these ribs just lightly coat these ribs with apple juice get you all in closer there Make sure you get it everywhere. This is going to help with the ribs to break down and still stay soft. Alright, got the apple juice on them. And if they didn't look good enough, here we go with the follow up with right rub. These color. This color in these ribs and the seasoning just looks great. Man, can't wait to try it. And I'm going to put Matador Meats information in the description box. That's what we're looking like, guys. Alright, let's get these back on the smoker. Y'all hang tight. Just wanted to update y'all guys. We are about 25 minutes out from the three hour mark. And we are sitting right under 250. Let me get y'all a closer look at that. Right under 250 on the smoker. Y'all hang tight and we'll uh, pull these ribs out and get a little bit more apple juice on them and um, see how they're looking. Alright guys, we're going to check on these ribs here. Um, what I didn't mention is we're also going to use their sauce. Right barbecue sauce, peach chipotle. Should go great with their rub. Let's do this here. Let's check these out. Smelling awesome. Wow, look at that, I'd say they're getting almost done here, I'm just gonna put our apple juice on here again, look at the pullback. sauce. These ribs are almost done. Give them 10 minutes with some sauce. Don't want a whole lot, but I do want to try it. I'm interested in some peach chipotle. Look at that color. And we're going to follow it up and finish it off with the all-purpose seasoning. Look at that color on these ribs. Really impressed with this cut of ribs also. Again, I'm going to leave Matador Meats link down in the description box. Y'all go check them out if y'all are interested. Man. Alright, we're going to put these in for about 10 or so more minutes. And then we're going to take them out and let them rest. Welcome back y'all. We are approaching the three hour mark. We're going to go ahead and pull these ribs off. They are done. Man. Can't wait to try them. Absolutely. 
absolutely gorgeous. Got my foil laid out right here. Get a bend on them. What we're gonna do before we wrap them, we're gonna wrap them quickly, but a little bit of apple juice on them. Welcome back, y'all. Would you look at these ribs? Golly. They turned out great. Y'all hang tight and I'll get them sliced up and I'll be right back with you. Welcome back, y'all. Check out how these ribs turned out. Wow. Beautiful. Perfect smoke ring. Let me get y'all a closer up lay on here. Look at that bark, that right rub, the right barbecue sauce. You can tell they're still juicy. Wow. Y'all hang tight. I'm gonna grab one and uh, give it a sample. All right, here's the moment of truth. The rib. Mmm, perfect bite. Mmm, that peach chipotle sauce in the, in the seasoning. Hey everybody, thanks for stopping by again and checking out the channel and watching us make those ribs with the Right Rub all-purpose seasoning. It was really great on those ribs. Nice sweet flavor with some heat. And then we can't forget the sauce we finished it off with right here. Right barbecue sauce, peach chipotle. Got a real good kick in there with some flavor. I appreciate y'all for watching. Y'all come back.